readers. Today, you're going to be reading a book called Look at Pickles. Let's go ahead and look at the cover of the book. All right, looking at the cover of this book, who do you think Pickles is? You can say, I think. Say it out loud. What do you think this book will be about? You can say, I think it will be about. Why do you think that? Yeah, I know. I think it might be about a dog named Pickles and maybe places that he goes because he's in the car. Let's go ahead and find the word Pickles on the front cover. We'll use the first letter sound. What is the first letter sound you hear in the word Pickles? Say it out loud. Pickles. What is the first sound you hear? What leather makes that sound? That's right. P makes the sound p, p, like p, p, pig. Can you help me find the word pickles on this page? Use that first leather sound to help you. Here it is, pickles. Let's double check by thinking about the last sounds we hear in pickles. What is the last sound at the very end that you hear in the word pickles? Say it out loud, pickles. I hear a s at the end. What letter makes the sound s? That's right, s, like s socks. Does this word end in the letter S? It does. It starts with a P and ends with a S. Can it be pickles? Yes, it can. That matches with the first and the last letter. Awesome. Let's look at a few other things in this book. Turn the page. Go to page two. All right, there are lots of sight words in this book. You can use sight words to help anchor your reading. You can read these words quickly and easily because you already know them by sight. Can you help me find the sight word is? Put your finger under the sight word is. Is. Can you help me find the sight word on? Put your finger under the sight word on. On. Can you help me find the sight word the? Put your finger under the sight word the. The. Awesome. Can you help me find the word pickles on this page? We already found it on the cover. Can you find it on this page? This is the picture of pickles. Can you find the word pickles? Pickles. We're gonna go ahead and read the book together. I'll read a page and then I want you to read it after me. Ready? We'll read the title first. Look at pickles. Your turn, make sure you remember to point under each word. Turn the page. Let's read the title again. Look at pickles. Your turn.
turn the page. Pickles is on the bed. Your turn. Turn the page. Pickles is in the bed. Your turn. Turn the page. Pickles is on the chair. Your turn. Turn the page. Pickles is on the table. Your turn. Turn the page. Pickles is in the car. Your turn. Turn the page. Pickles is on me. Your turn. The end. Before we move on and read it on our own, I want to teach you that we can combine information to figure out a word. For example, you already know that you can use the picture to help you figure out a word. And you know that you can use the first letter sound to figure out a word. But what if you used both at the same time? Let me show you how I do this. Turn back to this page. I'm on page eight. I'm going to read this page. Pickles is on the... Okay, the picture looks like he's on a table. And the first letter sound is T, 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 table. That matches. Notice how I use the first letter sound info and the information in the picture. Can you try that on the next page? Use the first letter sound and the picture together to help you figure out the word. Did you get it? What is pickles in? Pickles is in the car. You can also combine the first letter sound and the last letter sound to help you. If I think that this word is going to be car because of the picture, I can say k, starts with k and ends with er. What word could it be? Car. See how I did that? You can try that each and every time you read. Use all the information from the letters and the pictures together to help you figure out the word. Let's go back to the beginning. It's time for you to read. It's time for you to read the book on your own. You can use a paper copy if you have one, or you can just point under the words right on the screen. 
Make sure you use your pointer finger to point to each word and use all the information to help you figure out tricky words, such as the letters and the pictures. Go ahead, read the title. Turn the page, read the title again. Turn the page, read the words. 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 The end. Great job reading. So, what were some of the things that Pickles did? Yeah, he went on the table. He went in the bed under the covers. That was so funny. What kind of dog do you think Pickles is? Why do you think that? You can say, I think Pickles is a mm dog because... Yeah, maybe you think Pickles is a funny dog because he does all these funny things like going under the covers. Or maybe you think Pickles is a brave dog to go on top of the table and stuff and go in the car. Or maybe you think Pickles is the kind of dog that acts like a person. Awesome job. Thanks so much for reading with me today. I'll see you next time.